Unity schools were established in 1974, shortly after Nigeria's civil war. While the schools were regarded as the best in the country, attracting the best of brains from different ethnic, cultural, and religious divides, they also served as a tool to foster national unity among Nigerians. However, with the falling standards of education in the last 10 years, the same cannot be said of present-day unity schools. The sector is facing the issues with infrastructure. The federal government colleges that were built 40, 50 years ago, some of them still have abandoned projects, incomplete infrastructure. A unity school gave the youth at that time a broad, broad horizon to mingle with people that they have cultural differences with, zonal differences with, character differences with. Unity schools were built primarily for excellence. Admission into unity schools in those days were 70% on merit and then 30% on catchment. But these days, you know, they have turned from merit to what I might call um, um, a state school. In recent times, the unity schools are no more living the uh, expectation of uh, the founding fathers. Hardly you find somebody coming from Lagos, from Southwest, uh, coming to school in the North anymore. If you go to a proper federal government college of those days that we went to, you, you, you see Nigeria as a, a country not, I don't view from, I'm an Igbo man, I don't view from prison of Igbo person or Yoruba person or whatever. I view Nigeria as a country because Nigeria has done a lot to all of us that went to that place. While many of the students of such schools now fully grown adults continue to share a common bond, some of them recently converged on Abuja. They say the schools, now many of them with abandoned infrastructure, have lost their essence and continue to be plagued with poor standards. After the millennium, that is after the 2000s, we have discovered that most of these schools are no more unity schools as they used to be. Because you find out that the catchment areas for these schools has now become um, majorly the states, you know, for where it, they have been hosted. When you look at the standard of education that's been offered in those schools now, yes, they're doing a lot, but it is in no comparison to what we had in our own times. The, the sense of having having uh, ensuring united nigeria i'm sure that school from far, far and wide comes to a place and come together it's no longer there again they want something urgently done by the federal government to return its 104 unity schools back to its level of academic excellence we expect that now that the emergency state of emergency has been called um, there will be actionable points there will be clear tasks there will be funding given uh, to the schools, the reorientation of teachers, the strengthening of the system will be implemented, especially at the basic level of the basic education, because that's where it all starts. Amadin Uyi, Plus TV Africa.